if you flip the coin 10 times, got heads 8 times and tails only 2 times, you might be tempted to believe that if you do it again, since a tails flip is quote unquote overdue, the probability of getting tails is higher. That right there is the gambler's fallacy, also called the Monte Carlo fallacy or the fallacy of statistics. It's basically logically incorrect thinking that leads you to believe that because 10 coin flips already occurred, the 11th will be more predictable. The thing is, each coin flip is a completely independent event and the probability of obtaining tails is always 1 out of 2 or 50%. It's irrelevant whether this is your first coin flip or 10,000 of them occurred before. To put it differently, the belief that a statistically independent event like a coin flip is influenced by past results is deeply flawed. Of course, not all events are statistically independent like a coin flip. In a full deck of poker cards, for example, the likelihood of drawing an ace is 4 out of 52, so 7.69%. If, however, one is drawn, then only 3 are left, making the probability of drawing another ace drop to 3 out of 51, so 5.88%. All in all, it's important to remember that when it comes to statistically independent events, past performance doesn't matter.